This is the uh, memorial for Blue Angel pilot Captain Jeff Coos being constructed here in Smyrna, Tennessee. Guys, many of you uh, probably remember that uh, in 2016, the Blue Angels are practicing for the Tennessee Aviation Days Air Show here in Smyrna, Tennessee. Uh, on June 2nd of 2016, exactly two years to the day of the crash. Uh, this was uh, constructed yesterday on June 1st of uh, 2018 and uh, it's now under construction. It'll be completed in I think about another month. Uh, so it's an awesome uh, uh, memorial that's being built uh, for Captain Jeff Coos of the Blue Angels. Captain uh, Jeff Coos uh, was practicing for the air show when he performed what's called a split S maneuver where you go straight up and then you turn and come back down. Uh, he uh, did not uh, get enough height and they could not pull up in time and uh, the plane uh, crashed and he uh, wasn't able to inject in time. Now, it normally takes about three to four years to request a jet like this from the Navy, you know, if you're a museum or something like that. Uh, but because of the uh, circumstances surrounding uh, what happened here in Smyrna, a, uh, from what I understand, a rear admiral that is retired that lives here in Smyrna sent a letter to uh, the Navy uh, to speed things up, and they definitely did so. And they got this plane here in about a year's time. It has been stored on uh, in uh, one of the hangars here at the Smyrna Airport for about the last year until they could begin uh, the building of the memorial here at Lee Victory uh, Park in Smyrna. When it's completed, uh, it's going to look like the plane is taken off from the runway. So it's going to be pretty awesome when that is completed. Uh, so I think, again, I think in about a month or two it will be completed. Right now it's actually closed off uh, to the public. This is as close as you can get to it. The Blue Angels did announce that they will be returning to the Smyrna Air Show in 2019. So that ought to be a pretty special event. The day of the crash, uh, the people of Smyrna and surrounding areas all got together and uh, to show support of Captain Jeff Coos and his family, which is quite amazing as you can see. The uh, airplane was delivered here uh, by a tractor trailer, which was pretty awesome to see. Uh, again, I don't know, about a year ago, and then it was uh, stored in one of these hangars. All right, guys, I'm back here at the house now. Uh, that's awesome what they're doing out there in Smyrna to commemorate uh, the life of uh, Captain Jeff Coos. He was with the uh, United States Marine Corps, and uh, I'm not sure how long he flew for them, but uh, it's awesome that they're doing all that. Uh, again, it'll be all completed, from what I understand, in a month or so. So it's going to be awesome. Then you'll be able to walk right up to the plane and get pictures of it and all that. But uh, that's pretty awesome. Uh, I'm going to include uh, some video of the uh, Blue Angels flying at the Smyrna Air Show from 2014. Uh, they didn't fly the, the, uh, in 2016 because of the crash. So here's some awesome footage from the 2014 Air Show in Smyrna. Hope you enjoy.
outside. Each body performs an individual ritual. enjoyed some of that footage it was an awesome air show man the beautiful blue sky with some clouds from time to time it was awesome amazing air show i've been to every air show there since i was 15 years old uh, i can only remember missing one air show since then uh, i love aviation and uh go to air show whenever I get a chance so again they'll be back in smyrna in 2019 looking forward to it it's going to be an awesome air show guys you ought to go to it if you get the chance hopefully enjoy the uh, video footage and guys as always if you want to, whether you want to be a pilot, a fighter pilot, a shelf, a race car driver, whatever it is, guys, go for your dreams, take that leap of faith, and jump. We'll see you next time.